Greetings one and all, I'm Anand Panjbhai working as Junior Research Fellow at NIT Silchar. I have dual active bridge in my hand and I'll just take you through the different segments of this PCB. Here we can say that this is my control part and this is my power part. Here we can say 8 MOSFETs are there, there are 2 edge bridges we know, so 8 MOSFETs are there, so 8 driver circuits are designed over here and there is a power supply requirement for the driver, so we have made that onboard power supply over here. We can see that here we have to give 230 volt, 50 volt single phase AC supply and these onboard power supply circuits convert it into 3.3 volt. 5 volt and 15 volt DC respectively which is used to drive this driver circuit. Here you can see the 8 MOSFETs we have, we have connected upside down. So we can see 8 MOSFETs and heat sinks over here. Here 4 capacitors are connected across each leg of the um, uh, inverter to quench the switching noise generated due to high frequency switching. Now. Here we can say that this is our input port and output port. Input port is uh, this D, input DC is given over here and via fuse and common mode choke it is given to DC link capacitor. Then it is going to the primary bridge which is converting it into high frequency AC. That high frequency AC is given to transformer via inductor. The secondary of the transformer is further connected to this uh, second H bridge. And this edge bridge is converting it to DC. It is given to DC link capacitor and we get it at the output port. Thank you so much.